All right, hi. My name's Cole Roberts, and I'm a cowboy. So obviously, my truck's a cowboy truck. Well, let me tell you something about a cowboy truck. It's not made for riding on roads. It's made for riding on gravel and dirt. And it's made for work. All right. You see these dents and these scratches? We ain't get these by driving on asphalt. We got these by driving through the woods. Driving back where most, uh, you know, Kias and cars wouldn't dare to go. Because you know why? This is a cowboy truck. And that's what it's made for. Right. You see these tires? Well, some people might say these tires are a little bit worn. I say they're just nice and broke in. See that right there? That there says Ford. Pretty much the most American and the most manly cowboy truck you can find. Ford. Dependable. See this? This is a trailer hitch. Let me tell you right now, you don't have a trailer hitch, you aren't no cowboy. See these trailer hitch? They made for work. They're also made for getting your uh, horses around, like hauling a horse trailer just like that one. This ain't just a normal hitch, uh, you know, made for pulling little uh, sissy wagons. Uh, this is a trailer hitch made for pulling man horses, uh, like beasts like that. Alright, you see this? This is a tailgate. I ain't just any tailgate, it's a cowboy's tailgate. Now, good cowboy, he's always got a rope in his truck. You never know when you're gonna have to go rope some of your cattle. Now, when you grow up those said cattle, you tie them up, you throw it in the back of the truck, in the back of this cowboy truck. All right, this truck, it's made for hauling. It's made for getting the job done. It's not made to put groceries back there, you know, little city boys to see items. It's made to tie up cattle throw them right on back there all right now you may notice the inside of the cowboy truck is pretty dirty now uh us cowboys we're too busy working to keep the truck clean let me tell you put in too much time out there in the dirt to worry about keeping the dirt out of the truck now let me tell you something else about these cowboy trucks if you look here we always got bullets in the truck now you might be uh you know driving by you see a coyote go after one of your calves you got your coyote to protect your calf, keep your stock safe. You also might be driving through there, you know. You just see a little uh, buck and you know, it's driving through and you think, oh, that sucker would look real nice up on my wall and it's meat would be real nice in my freezer. So you do the only uh, cowboy thing to do, you shoot them. That's what you gotta do. All right, see this? This is a cowboy engine. It ain't just a normal engine. This ain't for you sissy boys. No, this is a cowboy engine. See this engine? It's gonna run forever. It's never gonna die. This engine got at least another two million miles in it. Yeah, and that's a conservative number, honestly. These, these engines just may never die. They might run absolutely forever. All right, see this? It's a sturdy engine. You know why? Because it's a cowboy engine. That simple. All right, now, these cowboy trucks, they ain't for everyone. There's a standard you gotta set whenever you go to try to get a cowboy truck. Now, see this hay? You gotta be able to throw this hay in the back of this truck like so. All right, let me tell you. You can't do that right there, you ain't no cowboy. You can't go get yourself a cowboy truck. It ain't for you. All right. Well, let me tell you. You don't own a cowboy truck, you ain't no cowboy. These trucks are some of the manliest men in America. Let me tell you right now, cowboys are the toughest kind of Americans. And uh, this truck is for true blue Americans. If you ain't us, don't go get yourself one. It's that simple. Alright? These cowboy trucks, they're just for a different breed. If you don't like to work till the sun goes down, you know, get out of bed when the sun comes up. You ain't no cowboy. It's that simple. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed that little skit um, that we did, and uh, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. And uh, let me know what kind of videos y'all want in the future, so I can pump those out for you guys and get some more funny videos like this one out there for y'all. So if you enjoyed, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you guys down the road.